In The Dogs Are Eating Them Now, Graham Smith tells a story of Canada's role in the ill-fated war in Afghanistan. Beyond bang-bang journalism or simple-minded patriotism, Smith takes readers on a vivid, boots-on-the-ground journey through an inhospitable landscape and an impossible military mission. It is a masterclass in war reporting that will be studied by Canadian policymakers and journalists for years to come. The first line from Graham's book, it just says, we lost the war in southern Afghanistan and it broke my heart. This book chronicles how his heart got broken. It's an emotional book. It's a, it's a book that touches you, that frightens you, but it also tells a really compelling story. You know, when I was in the Panjwe Valley on Operation Medusa, this huge battle that the Canadians were in, at one point um, they were exploding walls uh, to get rid of them so that soldiers could charge through the holes. And, uh, and uh, at one point there was all the, the debris falling and, and it, was sort of, it was like buildings literally raining down on us. And the experience of writing the book was almost like that in some ways. I just had to sit there and let all the pieces fall and, and see where they landed. It actually starts off with him being very hopeful and hope-filled for the mission. And then you see him losing his optimism. It's a book that should be read by anybody who wants a detailed, fine-grained understanding of how wars, how counterinsurgency strategies, how multinational coalitions can succeed and how they can fail in war. We lost a lot of soldiers there. We spent a great amount of our national sort of psychic energy being in Afghanistan. And I think nobody understands this war better than Graham Smith. And I think nobody has told that story as well as Graham Smith.